Yeah, I think um, those are the biggest teaching moments that I have. Um, I can think of two, and one of them I'll share, and, okay. and that's when you get fired. When you get fired from a dealership uh, or you know, from a position that you wanted, that you wanted to be in, it's not the dealership or the owner's fault. It's you, 100%. But you have to take that and you have to examine yourself and say, okay, look, what, what caused this failure? Um, was it, was it the way that I, I, I led people Did I, you know, did I not meet production? Did I not communicate? And you have to go back and do a self-diagnostic and ask yep. yourself the hard questions to figure out what do I have to do to make those changes? Because if you don't, the next time you go into a store, the next time you go into a position, um, the chances of you repeating history are a hundred percent. You're just going to fall down that same path. And we have seen people like this in our industry, have we not, uh, yeah. Russell, uh, Charity? We've seen people that like, dude, um, you've worked at five stores in four years, all right? Uh, I get it. I mean, well, maybe they're all not a fit, but five and four tells me it's probably not the store. It yeah. might be you. And that's when, you know, you got to sit down and, and say to yourself, self, what do I got to do to be different? 